It's the most magical time of the year, the time when couples around the world get engaged to the love of their life. From golf courses to casino ballrooms, there are ample places to say your I do's. But have you ever thought about getting married at one of the venues inside of the city of Las Vegas? It's affordable. Um, there's different types of spaces, unique spaces. We've got a couple of those historic spaces that are very um, different and hold sentimental value or they're a local attraction for folks. You may not realize all of the options the city provides. We have community center ballrooms, parks, and cultural centers that are all available for your big day. The top three Las Vegas venues are the East Las Vegas Community Center, the historic Fifth Street School, and of course, Floyd Lamb Park. Floyd Lamb is um, just a beautiful green space. We don't get that a lot in the valley. There's water out there. We've got the birds, the peacocks. It's just it's very natural and a uh, very natural space that people just love to have as a backdrop to their wedding. The historic Fifth Street School is another popular choice. There are options for an indoor or outdoor wedding. Mark and Gary couldn't have been happier with their choice to get married here. I mean, we obviously love the, the, the look of the venue because Gary um, is a teacher uh, and it was an old school and um, we both are retired performers and there was a stage. So we did a very big, fun dance party evening. Um, we did not have a traditional cake. We used one side of the gymnasium for a dessert bar um, and we just had a, a big party and the history school was perfect for us. They emailed us, they called us, they returned our calls and emails. They were on top of it at every step for literally a year and a half, right up until uh, the day of the venue. They were fantastic. For Alicia and Edward, choosing a city venue allowed them to customize their wedding. They got to bring in their own vendors and hold the celebration they wanted. What I liked about this is that it was very um, uh, a la carte and we were gonna be able to draw it out uh, the way that we wanted to. Uh, being from uh, multiple cultures, uh, you know, it definitely allowed for that. I think the wedding was just perfect between the venue, the day itself, like blue skies, no winds, anything. It was like perfect yeah. 70s weather. Everything parted. Huh? Yeah, it was just like <laughs> everything was speaking that it was meant to happen here, happen how it happened. But don't wait too long to book. The facilities fill up fast. We are already getting bookings for next fall because that is a popular time of year to get married here in Las Vegas. The weather is beautiful. If you're having your wedding outdoors, that's a, just a beautiful time of year to be out there. So thinking about the season that you're getting married in, we could say three to six months as far as lead time. But if you're getting married during peak season, you may want to give yourself a year. As for cost, that varies on the size of facility you need. In some cases, the city can provide tables and chairs. In other places like parks, that's up to you. All things to consider when planning your big day. If you'd like to get more information on renting one of the cultural centers, just call 702-229-5902. If you'd like to rent out a community center ballroom or park space, you can call 702-229-1087.